So the secret is really start with what you want. And then from there, you'll find that you start becoming a better person. Start with what you want. Yeah, start with what you want, not with what find you think what you really, really want. And not what, like you're willing to settle for, but like literally if there were no rules. Yeah. Not like, well, I want a girl who's, you know, if I have a wife, I'm going to want her to be like, what if you didn't have a wife? Like, yeah. oh, is that an option? Yeah. Like, think, rethink all of it and then decide yeah. what do you want? Yeah. And then how will I then go get that? And then that's the beginning of life. And that's the beginning of like when you really start experiencing novelty and you start experiencing that thing. You know that thing, that flutter in your chest where you're like, oh. What? When you consider a thing that you want but you're scared to go for it and you decide to go you know like when a simple example being when you're up on a high platform to jump into a pool yeah and that moment before you jump you're like <gasps> that feeling it's this rush it's this excited it's this ex- right when you're about to take mushrooms yes oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. yeah no, or it's right when you're about enjoy. to try to kiss just the girl it. oh, it's right yeah. when you're about to try to kiss the girl oh that's a that's a flutter like yeah like this. that no. flutter is how you know you're knocking on the door of success that what? flutter is how you know that you're knocking on the door of novelty because that flutter means you're outside you your com- a new place yes it's not like when you kiss a girl that you already kissed 50 times yeah there's no flutter then it's when the first time Woo! There's nothing like that feeling. You're leaving your comfort zone. You're leaving your comfort zone, and people will spend their entire lives trying to avoid that. Trying feeling. to avoid the flutter. Yeah, trying to avoid. The, don't avoid the flutter. You've, that flutter is the sense of acceleration as you move through the multiverse into a reality that is a reality where you are more yourself, where you are a happier person. Yeah, I convinced in college. I convinced this guy in my dorm, and he liked this girl. And I was like, "Well, ask her." I goes, "No, I can't. What's gonna happen?" I'm like, "Dude," and I broke it down. I'm like. Literally, what's the worst that can happen? Yeah. Is that she'll just say no, yeah. or she'll have a boyfriend or something. And then he went up to her in the dining hall yeah. and asked her, and she goes, <laughs> with you? Are you serious? <laughs> no. It was way worse than I thought. Yeah. But generally, the worst that can happen <laughs> is not that bad. I was Here's like, the thing, oh, though, I man. I shouldn't have told but, you to do that. But, no, man. Here's the thing, dude. In my mind, regardless of the pain that your friend experienced and the fact that he probably immediately went the next day to the hospital to have his <laughs> testicles removed. <laughs> aside, aside from that, that person was a man. That person was a hero. That person engaged in a battle, and he lost. He went for it, though. But he went for he it. Engaged. And God fucking damn it, engaging in something and getting your ass kicked. Make you better the next time. Make you better the next time. And in that moment, you did a thing that was great. You did a thing that was not mediocre. Because if you go, if you conquer your fear and go for it, that there is, you are not being mediocre in that moment. Mediocrity yeah. is always based on not taking chances.